This video is brought to you by BoardGamePrices.com. Find the best prices for board games at BoardGamePrices.com. Kia ora koutou and welcome to Space Corp in about 3 minutes. Review copy used. It is a game for 1 to 4 players. It has a solo mode complete with its own rulebook. Playing times around 1 hour per error. It's a pretty complex game. Humanity is taking its first steps into a wider world. A rocket to the moon, orbital stations, then onto Mars. Next comes the belt, the Jovian moons, and the great gas giants. Finally, we leave the confines of our solar system and begin the long journey into the void to new stars. Can you build a corporation that can control the vast reach of space. You win if at the end of the game you have the most profit. Space Corp is unusual in that you can choose to play one, two, or three errors of play and end the game at the end of any error. Each error ends once two players pass or six of the seven objectives have been completed. Competitive. Only one corporation can be the most successful. Card management. Actions in this game use cards. Engine building. Infrastructure and science cards give your corporations ongoing advantages. Player turn. On your turn you will take one main action and some secondary actions. Most most actions have a numerical strength associated with them, as shown on the cards. Your infrastructure cards, when placed on your board, add to the strength of any cards played. For example, we have two research infra and play a two research card. This gives us a research total of four. Research is how you gain new cards, and you can take them from the face up offers or from the top of the deck. Any card that says, may upgrade as infra may be added to one of your infra slots and you may replace cards in those slots as well. The move action allows you to move one of your teams from base to a site within range. We have four move here and it costs two to leave Earth's gravity, one to go to the moon and one to land. The explore action needs an explore value equal to or higher than the area's E rating, in this case one. You then get an exploration token, flip it and gain any rewards. You can build using the build action. This needs to be a higher value than the B rating on the location you're building on and the base needs to work with the exploration token. A refinery on exotic elements is a match, a spaceport would not be. You can also produce at a base with a P score, gaining profit equal to that score, plus one for this refinery. After your main action, you can claim an objective, move teams between bases, and if you have less than four cards, you draw one. The second era introduces radiation, which makes space travel more costly, as well as technologies you can discover with the revelations and genetics actions. The final era introduces interstellar travel, which takes multiple turns and colony building. Infrastructure gets better through each age to help you, but the distances between things get much, much bigger. Why would you like this game? Space Corp strikes a wonderful balance between having the depth to make space exploration feel epic while not being overwhelmingly complex. This there's some randomness in the token draw when exploring, which makes you adapt your strategies, although you may prefer to play without the tokens that only punish players when they explore. The three-act structure of the game not only allows you to enjoy the game in smaller servings if you want to, it also acts as a guided tutorial, as each error adds new mechanics and concepts. The acts also contribute to a genuine sense of progression throughout the game, as you go from humble lunar landing to your first interstellar colony. The best thing about this game is how damned legible the cards are. I can't get over how easy they are to read from across the table. However, the time card which can give you double actions are a little swingy and luckily drawing them can be a huge advantage. And while it's not the most complex game, you'll definitely need to play it twice in order to get how the different systems work together. For a more detailed game about space exploration, try Leaving Earth. And if you like this idea but want something far, far simpler, try Farlight. Space Corp, it's full of stars. If you enjoyed this video, like it, subscribe to the channel and support us on Patreon.